downriver man wants everyone to know about the bus boy who saved his life. 79 year old Jerry Broll was dining at the Ramshorn in Southgate a couple of weeks ago when he started choking. Pamela Osborne picks up the story from there. Jerry was eating alone at this table when some of his food got lodged in his throat. He was in a desperate situation, unable to talk, unable to breathe. Fortunately for him, he didn't have to wait for help to arrive. Help was already here. It was a corned beef and Swiss cheese sandwich, by the way. One of those thick ones. These days, 79 year old Jerry Broll says he treats his food with a lot more respect. The former EMT was eating that corned beef and Swiss sandwich at this booth when some of it became stuck. It got lodged, uh, so I grabbed my throat, started gesturing that I needed help. I saw him kind of motioning towards his throat. I was frightened. Uh, I, mean, I couldn't breathe, couldn't talk. And he was kind of a little blue in the face and and he started waving me over. That's 19 year old Aaron Kay. He's a bus boy at the Ramshorn restaurant and was the first one to notice Jerry in distress. When I first saw it, every nerve in my body just was like, oh crap. He didn't but, panic. In fact, he knew exactly what to do. I knew I had to do something because I knew how to do something. So. After helping Jerry to his feet, he performed the Heimlich maneuver. I came up behind him and I put my hands like this, uh, like right under his abdomen so, uh, and just pushed in and up. A few moments later, Jerry's airway was clear to everyone's relief. He was breathing again. Aaron says he learned the technique from his mom, who is a lead medical assistant at Henry Ford. He really did good. He did a good job. This was their first time seeing each other since that day. And since Jerry's heartfelt thank you to the young man who saved his life went viral. I was super happy that he was OK. Uh, that made my day, you know, to know that he was OK, to know that he posted about it. You take care of yourself. You too. Yeah, all right. All right. I've seen you because I. Yeah, yeah, I'm sure I'll see you around. And really, what are the odds that a man who spent 30 years of his life teaching and performing emergency life saving medicine would find himself on the receiving end of that care from a 19 year old who learned that skill as a kid? Reporting in Southgate, I'm Pamela Osborne, Local 4.